Hello everyone, this is Adam for realhomerecording.com. If you own an audience interface, then listen up because when it comes to headphone monitoring, especially when playing drums, every decibel counts. Now, by default, your headphone is set to the Q mix, or that's typically what you would pick, right? However, the maximum gain on each Q fader goes up to that setting right there. Now, if you were to adjust this knob right here, it only affects the main mix. So, that's the level you get with the Q mix slider. This right here is the maximum, is equal to that. But, if you want another six decibels of gain, really volume level, then switch your speakers to the Q mix and switch your headphones to the main mix and then push this slider up along with your DAW audio, push this up as well. And there you have it, six more decibels of gain now, if you don't mind sharing settings with the speakers, then obviously you can keep them right there. But typically when you're recording somebody else, or even if you're just recording yourself, you want to have two different mixes set up if you have speakers in your control room or what have you. So I would definitely keep the mixes separate just like that again. Now I have put in a feature request to Audient a few months ago to make it so that the Q mix can be boosted louder like this, but I'm not gonna hold my breath on that happening. If they do it, then awesome. If not, now you know how to get six extra decibels of volume in your headphone mix. Hit that like button, subscribe, and hit that bell notification button as well next to the subscribe button if you like this video. This has been Adam for realhomerecording.com.